Now, diversity, equity, and inclusion. The DEI makeover bill moving forward at the state capitol. It's closely watched, draws strong opinions, and the Senate has now spoken. Brian Malahi live at the capitol tonight and shares how this bill could impact our Utah schools. Yeah, this turns diversity, equity, and inclusion programs in schools into student success centers. It quickly cleared the House, and today it was the Senate's turn. This bill focuses resources on students that are at risk, and it focuses on opportunity for all. A good feeling for some. And as I read through this, I, I got an uneasiness. And dread for others. I know this bill is, um, is politically charged. In the debate, how to define diversity, equity, inclusion, racism. I believe that's fundamentally a deficiency in this process, um, not utilizing the term, terms. While DEI may mean different things to different people, some universities are using it to discriminate. Skepticism over what might be in schools. How are they going to learn about disproportionate arrests and sentencing, racial profiling, about disparities in school discipline? Met with hope for what might be. What we need to do is to provide an environment where everyone, if they work hard and they want to, they can succeed. Party line vote in the Senate today, 23 Republicans for the DEI makeover, six Democrats opposed. Final vote in the Senate could happen as early as tomorrow. Live at the Capitol, Brian Malahi, KUTV 2 News.